Phantom Train. I mean, can you believe this? Can it possibly get any weirder? You know what I'm going to do? No, I'm not going to do that. And we got more random encounters. Samurai and Brain Man. Samurai's weak against Poison, Brain Man. I didn't write down Brain Man. Hmm. So I guess we don't know. Might as well use the Poison. Well, that's probably going to kill him anyway. You know what? Let's just fight him. Hell, oh, man. Yeah, I would guess that those guys are weak against both because their swap, um, their palette swaps always are, so. So. There's not much of a point to Airblade when there's only one enemy left, but eh, do it anyway. Do it again. Oh, yeah. Two magic points. Is somebody learning Flare? I don't even know. So, anyway. And moving right along. Get to the second car, and whoa, there goes Cyan. Hey, wait a minute. He's having flashbacks, I guess. Oh, there comes a ghost. Oh, dear me. There's two switches here. Seems to be a treasure chest here. Sometimes those Rain Man guys will actually put Saban to sleep, or put you to sleep. Now, if you try to move to get this treasure chest, this other treasure chest that's already open will move in and block you. So what you have to do... Fine, then. Pull this switch right here. And that'll close three of the treasure chests. Now, you have to remember which three are closed there. You'll need to remember that later. So, I've got a book here. Memorize the positions. This knowledge might save you. Receive the lump of metal. Well, if you take this lump of metal back over here and put it in here, it'll stop this treasure chest from moving, and you can get the other one, which is a flame shield. What kind of shields have we got equipped anyway here? Oh, okay. Oh, that looks pretty good, then. We'll give him, uh, that. Speaking of which, I need to really do this right here. I don't know why I didn't check this out sooner. Um, yeah, what the hell. What's he got? It's like in that movie Big, what's he got? If you have any idea what I'm even talking about, you're crazy. I don't know, I'm worried about this treasure just back here, but I think... Hey, you know what I'm actually going to do? I'm going to move everyone to the front row because these guys are not damaging us at all. I mean, I'm not even bothering to heal. Aha! Well, that would make sense. Barbie, Samurai, and Suri Yonder. Oh my gosh. Let's see. Well, Barbie's weak against poison, so we'll start there. Three Yonder's weak against Holy, so I should have saved Saban to do that, but, um, what was the other one? Well, I guess we're not going to find out. These guys are going to go down pretty quickly. Well, yeah, the Pearl Lance is Holy, so that would have worked, too, so. Just the sheer physical damage we're doing here. Oh, man. Uh, are you supposed to not get a random encounter between here and the treasure chest? That's not going to work. Wow, now that Barbie did some weird stuff there, let me tell you. Um, first, first she cast Imp on us, or that might have been a different monster that did that, and then she cast something where he actually protected her. So when I tried to attack her, one of my other party members, you know what, forget it, I'm not going to try to get that. Because that's just crazy, man. So then you come in here and you got these... These three switches will actually move the furniture around. So, well, let's see here. We'll start by flip low. Okay, that was kind of nasty. Um, that love token spell is really weird. I don't know if it would cause him to protect her against our magic, too. But basically, when she casts that on a character, that character jumps in to protect the monster anytime you try to hit him, so... Put the first switch here. That'll get you around these boxes. Then flip the third one. Assuming that we're going 3, 2, 1 here. Then go back and flip the first one again. Now flip the second one. I know this is complicated, but this is how it's done. First one again. And then the third one. Okay, and back here to flip the first one, the third one, whatever. I don't think I did that right. Oh wait, maybe I did. 
because now they come under here. Now you got to flip these treasure chests the way they were before. Okay, before we finish that up, we need to uh, take care of this imp crap here. You know, even as imps, you can actually fight pretty well, and there's care. There's actually equipment that you can use as an imp that makes you pretty powerful. I think I actually have some of it too. I might show that to you. That is part of the game, after all. Save point. Big whoop. Moving right along here. And this, you pretty much do the same as you did before. Uh, just flip the first and third ones. Third one's already flipped, though, so. And then once you leave, you end up in the Narsh Mines with a sepia tone. That's very weird. Oh, there's Cyan right there. Where's he going? He's checking stuff out. Uh oh, he's running. Oh my goodness. Soldiers are after him. And we got Io. That's very weird. All you can use is Bolt Beam, so you might as well. Or you can use X Magic, but you might as well save the points. This stuff is pretty powerful. And this is the last time you'll be using Magitek armor in the game. It's really ominous that you're using it anyway, but... Man, I am so worried about that battery right now. It's not even funny. So it'll come through under here. And... This place is really strange, because you can... Oh, Pluto armor. Sky cap. It's all machines, so use your bolt beam. That's all there is to it. Notice they're just doing nothing to us. I mean, this is one of those quests I think I probably should have done earlier, like as in before the Phoenix Cave. I remembered a couple of other things I need to do. I need to take Locke back to Narsh and open up all the doors in there now, because now that you got him, you can do that. And you actually get a cursed shield there, which I'll show you is very interesting. Let us see here. Now, if I remember right, you could actually end up going in circles. Okay, let's just keep on moving then. We're going in circles again, aren't we? Well, I sure would love to have a Moogle charm right about now. Hey, we just gained some levels here. I just know that battery's gonna run out. So the trick to this, you just have to turn around and go back to where you came from. But uh-oh, the bridge just collapsed. Where are we going to end up now, boy? Ah, we're back in the castle. Okay, then. Ooh. Oh, my goodness. Please save my husband. Save Cyan. Where are we? We're inside Cyan's soul. My husband, Cyan continues to torture himself. He fails to defend Dolan. The world's slowly dying. And then there's his family. A beast known as Rexel is taking advantage of him. Rexel is a composite monster made up of wretched spirits who were dispatched in meaningless wars. They're wreaking havoc on Papa. Please help him. Yes, yes, will do. Just let us go. Before the battery runs out. I'm so, if, if, it, if this video goes off at some random point, it's going to be because the battery ran out. I have to warn you about that now. I let it charge for some time, but I'm still worried about it. Ether. Elixir. Nice. So we need to make way for the throne room. Is. We want Cyan back. You're too late. His pain has reached critical mass. Nothing can stop his feelings of rage and despair. I grow stronger now with his anger, hatred, and guilt, and I hunger for you 